Hello everyone, my name is Noel Gregory and I'm here today to introduce you to Ready to Paint the Masters and it's Claude Monet. But before I start I'd like to show you two pictures I painted in Monet's house of his gardens and his bridge. The first one is Monet's garden and his studio. It's been kept very much like it was when Monet lived there and he loved uh, irises and also water lilies, but irises are one of his favourite flowers and he called his garden his favourite creation. We can argue against that, but uh, it certainly is a very beautiful place to be. The second one is his bridge with irises or flags in the, in the foreground. A bit early yet for water lilies, but it's a Japanese bridge that he painted so many times, almost a series of pictures in all weathers and all seasons. This bridge became synonymous with his paintings and he painted it so many times. And uh, I love doing this picture. It's from an image on the internet and uh, it works extremely well. Start this picture. Well, he wouldn't have a white canvas, that's absolutely certain. There's not a lot of information about how money worked, but he would not have had a white canvas. So we cover that canvas with a colour and since it's green to start with we use a mixture of green. I've got to wear these glasses I'm afraid. <laughs> Age creeps up on us. There we go. So I've mixed up a green. This is a chrome green which is one of the greens he used. I'm going to go over the whole lot. Just scrub this in, get it in quickly as we can. Not a lot of time for this. Have a good time. Get rid of all the white of the canvas. There we go. There's some... Can you see what I'm doing here is just adding this sunshine. It's the sunshine bit so important and it's not a lot of work to, to do it's just that it just adds a little two one or two flicks of of color and interest to the picture as uh, what money would have done he would have spent time obviously doing this but more time than I've got but he would have enjoyed it because he's looking there where the sun's catching the top there's a there's a, there's a light area here which certainly comes down here um, there's one here look there. No more, no more. Um, yes, yes, and a little bit of white up there. There we go. Well, there you are. There's the finished picture. Um, you can carry on yourself, dabbing away, putting on different colours, building up the textures, building up the tones, and building up the colour. But there's limited time for me to show you that now. But I'm quite pleased with it. It works reasonably well. Uh, it's, it's quite lively. It has some quite nice colours and tones working in it. And um, I hope you've enjoyed the demonstration. And um, I hope you will try many of the ready to paint money images. And for me, Noel Gregory, it's goodbye. <laughs>